Welcome to our series on this CAT or Computer Application Technology Prac Exam Paper 1 from November 2024 for Grade 12. And we are looking at Question 2, which is the second word question. Just a reminder that all the data files and the question papers are available via a link in the video description. So I really suggest that you go click on that link, download the files, go try out the question first, and then come back here and find out which questions you struggled with. So let's get stuck into Question 2 then. So we are dealing with two moon which is a word question which I've got open over here and let's see what they want us to do now first question 2.1 insert the slice dark cover page and remove the additional content control besides the title so let's go we're going to insert a cover page so we just come straight here to insert and there you can see cover page and we want the slice dark now if I look for the word slice dark there you can see the word slice dark so that's the one they're obviously referring to and there you can see it and they said we must remove the additional content control besides the title so if I move my mouse over here if I click on that you see that one is the title and this one is the subtitle so we're going to remove this content control so we can just cut that content control completely away so we've got the title there's nothing else i can see there so there we go so that's how we've got it all set up then let's move on to 2.2 change the line spacing of a paragraph to start with introduction and end with the moon since to be exactly 20 points within hanging indent of one centimeter so let's first go find this paragraph so we're going to scroll down so there's our paragraph so it's starting from there and if i just try to find i think the, there's the last bit so i think it's all of these paragraphs i'm gonna select all of this text we want the line spacing to be exactly 20 points and a hanging indent of one centimeter so if we come here to the home and we come here to paragraph you could also right click and click paragraph so we want the line spacing to be exactly 20 points so we're going to move that up to 20 and we want a hanging indent now that's a special one so we can say a hanging indent of one centimeter so we're going to change it to one centimeter so those with the properties that we must change going to click okay and so it should look something like that so you can see our hanging indent and you can see the line spacing is exactly 20. Then 2.3, find and replace all the occurrences of the ex exact word planet. Now they put that word in there for a reason, so take note of that. So we want to change the word planet with small caps effect, formatting and raise the position of the text by three. We're going to come here and we're going to go to our find replace. So we can see there's the find, there's the replace. So if I click on the replace, we want to find the word planet. And they said replace all the words exact words planet with a small caps effect so we still want the word planet to be there but it must just now have a different effect so we're going to change it with the word planet but now my mouse is on the replace part so now i can come here and change things for example we want to change the font to be small caps so i'm going to click on small caps it must be small caps and we want to raise the position of the text by three points so that we want to raise the position of the text by three points so if i come here to advance then we're going to click on position we want the position to be raised by three points so you can see it's raised slightly by three points but they want the exact word so we're going to make sure when we click OK, that when we look for that word, we want to find whole words only. And I'm just going to click on match case just to make sure that we get exactly that. So I think the key here is the whole words. We don't want to, the word planet to be somewhere else or planets. It must be like that. So let's go and replace all. We're going to come here to replace all. And it says it's done four replacements. So if I click OK and close, if we look for the word planet, if I go here and find the word planet, there you can see, there you can see that it's in all caps. And there you can see that it's been raised by three points. So I think that is correct. I looked at the memo. It did say that there are four results. So we did get all four results. So I'm happy with that. So let's move on to 2.4. Insert an automatic bibliography below the text question 2.4 in the APA style. So we're going to come here. Let's find bibliography. If we scroll down, I'm sure it'll be somewhere down here. There we go. There it is. So we want to insert a bibliography over here. So we come here to references. And we want to insert a bibliography. But you'll notice at the moment it's set to Harvard so I'm going to select APA and then insert the bibliography so I think that's question done find the text below the heading moon phases for 2024 there it is there's the text and format the text to appear as shown below we want this text to appear like that so they've given us the ruler deliberately so we can see the tabs can you see all the tabs there so there are three tabs there that we're going to need to incorporate and you'll see that there's a leader over here on this tab yeah so let's see what we've got if we come to our 
page of the app we've got note if I select this text there is already a tab there so let's go select everything and at the moment it's got a left tab at position 4 and it's got a left tab at position 4 so if I click on that tab I double click on that tab we can see that it's got a leader already it's at position 4 I'm happy with that so that I'm happy with now if I come over here yeah we can see that there is another left tab at position 11 so if I click on that 11 do you see that there is a right tab at 11 but we need to change that to a left so I'm going to click on the left for that one and set that 11 one to a left tab and then you'll notice here is another center tab at eight and a half so 8.5 so I'm going to come to here and type in 8.5 and click on center and I'm going to set that tab over there so we've got the four tabs there I actually want to click on it and just double check do we see any oh do you notice that there's little dots there let's have a look do we have dots we don't have dots there so I've got a feeling we need to put some sort of leader on it so there's a whole bunch of dots that lead up until the center tab so we're going to come to the center tab and we want it to be dot on the center tab so I'll say set and let's click OK and see what happens and does it here we go does it look exactly like it is there we go I think it's exactly how we want it to be we've got that to be a left tab we've got the little lead over there with the time and it looks exactly how it should be then 2.6 change the orientation of the last page only to landscape so we're going to go to the last page so we are on the last page over here so whenever you are doing a last page and we come here to the layout if we change the orientation to landscape it's going to change for all the pages so what I'm going to first do is I'm going to click here on phase of the moon I'm going to insert a section break so we can cl clearly see a brand new section if I click over there you can see that there's a section break over here which is different to this section so when I click on this page and change its layout to a landscape page you'll notice that it does not affect the page above it because of the section break and then 2.7 replace the text watermark okay we do watermarks again with the symbol which is webdings character code 224 of an 800 point size so we must replace the text watermark so we're going to come over here so there is the word moon so, so we're going to come here to design and there's the watermark and we're going to go let's go custom watermark and we want it to be a text watermark we don't want the text moon we want to insert a moon symbol so if we change the font to webdings now to get that character so if you want to get a special character you can press the alt on your keyboard and then on your keypad you can type that number but I think you must put in a zero and then the 224 so if we came here and press alt naught 224 on my keypad I get that symbol I'm gonna try make it a size 800 and if we apply it oh do you see how we got that moon over there so there we go so we got that moon over there that's how we got it so just to recap so I changed it to text and to get that particular symbol to get a code you can press alt and then on the keypad of your keyboard not the top above the text on the keypad you can type in the number but always it's a four digit number normally so type in 0224 and I got that symbol but because it's webdings it'll make it look like that which is exactly what we want in 800 they don't say anything about the color in that I think that's correct so we can click OK and be happy with it so then our last one 2.8 add the file path in the footer of the document so I'm going to come here to the footer I'm going to click on the footer somewhere here at the bottom and we can insert the file path so I can come here to document info and there you can see the file path and I've just clicked that like that if you click on it you see it goes gray that means it's a predefined field that we've put in you should be able to right click on it and update the field that way you know it wasn't just typed in manually so there we go I think that's the last little bit I think that question's done that was quite quick so that's our last of the word question for this paper for more exam papers make sure that you subscribe to our YouTube channel at Miss Long IT and Cat make sure that you go check out the playlist tab and you'll find all the help you need as well as other exam papers to go through remember to be a subscriber we really appreciate it and don't do it the long way do it the Mr. Long way